By the end of 2027, GS1's ambition is to migrate to a new generation of barcodes that offers infinite possibilities compared to the current barcode. But what is this next generation of barcode? It is a QR code with GS1 digital link that will replace the traditional barcode we're all used to. Its format is much smaller than the current barcode and is also able to contain much more information. But wait, isn't that just a regular QR code? Well, no. Here are the main differences between a simple QR code and the QR code with GS1 digital link. First of all, a regular QR code points to only one web page. Usually, this is the home page of the brand. The QR code with GS1 digital link also serves as a link to the digital world. But additionally, it allows you to access multiple and different web pages or online databases. So you have one single barcode serving all needs with personalized content depending on the application used to scan it. For example, it can link to the home page of the brand when scanned by the camera from a smartphone, but it can also link to recycling information when scanned by a dedicated application. Second big difference. The regular QR code cannot be scanned at the retailer's point of sale, simply because it contains a URL and not the product identification code or GTIN. Whereas a QR code with GS1 digital link is a URL that also contains the GTIN. This means it can replace the classic barcode we all know at the point of sale. Besides integrating the GTIN in the digital link URL, you could also integrate, for example, a lot number or a best before date. This can help to automate processes, such as giving automatic price reductions when a product nears its expiry date. You can even block it if expired. In summary, thanks to the next generation of barcodes and the GS1 digital link, you will be able to do so much more with only one barcode. One scan, infinite possibilities. Do you want to know more?